This past week, the primary investigator, Detective Marcy Kaszowski, and I traveled to London Heathrow Airport to escort 37-year-old Alvin Jackson Go back to Canada to face outstanding charges of theft over $5,000, possession of stolen property over $5,000, and money laundering. He was in England because, despite there being an agreement with his defence lawyer, Crown Counsel assigned to the file and the Edmonton Police Service, Go failed to turn himself in on May 16th, and we were forced instead to obtain an international arrest warrant through Interpol. He was then arrested in London on May 25th and held in custody while we made arrangements to have him return to Canada. He's currently awaiting a bail hearing. How unusual is it for you to have to go overseas to collect somebody? Well, for me, very unusual. Um, I haven't done this before. And as far as the service goes, I, I do know of one other instance where this occurred, but um, I'm not really familiar on how many cases there have been. It was fairly painless. Um, just sitting in the on the plane, just like any other patron, uh, trying to be, you know, downplayed as much as possible. We don't want to um, alarm anyone, and uh, so we just have a conversation about things that are not related to the file and eat. And he watched a couple of movies, and that was about it. Do you deal with primarily like financial factors that were your, your area? No, that's primarily what I don't deal with. Oh. No. I work in a patrol support team downtown division, so we just deal with most of the calls that are affected by patrol, but a lot of our files are, are violent crime. So this was a little bit out of the norm for what I would typically investigate, yes. Yes, it was a challenge and I did enjoy it, yes.